So what's going on guys? Today Commonwealth Motorsports in Hayes, Virginia is putting on this uh, 2022 beta demo day. They brought out eight brand new different beta models. I'm good, thank you. They brought out eight different brand new beta models and uh, we get to just, you know, go out and take them through a little trail loop. Trail loop isn't all that long, but it's a whole lot of fun and you get to see and feel the different characteristics of all these bikes. All right, so now we're gonna take a little spin on the 2022 Beta 250RR two-stroke. The only thing about these demo bikes is like the levers, oh, they're real tight, you can't move them. All right, so first ride, first test ride on the 2022 Beta 250RR two-stroke. I've been talking to some people here and the one guy says he thinks I'll like the 250 better than the 300. As I said in the beginning of the video, Commonwealth Motorsports in Hayes, Virginia is putting on this demo day. If you're interested in buying a Beta, definitely reach out to them. I'll have a link in the description with their website link and their phone number. Definitely get yourself hooked up on one of these awesome Beta motorcycles through Commonwealth Motorsports. Okay, so compared to the 300, the 250 definitely feels like a little bit more manageable power. Like it's fast, but it doesn't feel like it's constantly going to get out of control if I'm, if I'm not careful. It definitely seems like it's a little bit more user friendly. stump there definitely like the uh the two stroke line up here with beta oh yeah and the course we're actually now getting like some ruts in some lines put in place I always, I'm always like surprised by how easy the bigger board bikes are to ride because of that low end grunt, that low end torque. It makes it a lot easier to get out of uh, tight corners. You don't have to clutch nearly as much. I'm used to my 150 two stroke. rocket ship man she's still lightning fast if I could pop the uh, race edition suspension on this thing man that would be wicked this thing is very nice to ride I think it's probably just a little bit easier to ride than the 300 because the power doesn't feel unmanageable. I don't feel like I'm gonna get out of control at any time. All right. We got some traffic. Here we go. Oh my God. Should we go for the pass? No. <laughs> we don't wanna embarrass ourselves. I'd go to pass and end up just 
You're looking like an idiot. <laughs> oh man. We're gonna have to ride it again because that's like my favorite section right there at the end. We're gonna have to do one more lap. I don't think of myself as like all that fast, but I feel like I'm catching people awfully, awfully fast, a lot faster than I would have expected. See, the front just feels like it has a little bit of head shake every once in a while. I feel like the race edition suspension would clear that up nicely. Almost overshot that rut. I could ride these things all day. Trail riding truly, truly is like my favorite type of riding. It's fun just like whipping in and out of trees. It's hard to like find complaints about any of these bikes. They're all, they all just feel very, very good in their own ways. He might be right about the 250. You might be right though about the power and everything. Not once did I ever feel like it was out of my control. Yeah. Funny fast. Yeah, oh yeah, it's funny. Yeah, it's funny fast. <laughs> you're what? Oh, uh, that's awesome, man. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I saw him one video, right? Yeah. And then after that, he's like, hey, Derek. So I'm like, hey, <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, okay. What's your name? Kenny. Kenny? Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you, Kenny. Yeah, I'll try to put this in one of the videos so he can. What's your son's name? His name is Harvey. Harvey? Yeah. Shout out to Harvey. It was awesome meeting your dad at the beta demo day. Hey, All right, man. Have fun riding. I hope you guys really enjoyed watching this video, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.